the difference really between Invisalign and actual braces is I tell people our end result will be the same. Usually the end result is the same. The biggest change is how often, and I ask patients, how quickly do you want to see changes? Because that's the biggest difference between conventional braces and Invisalign. With conventional braces, you often notice changes very quickly. And I say within the first three months, you notice dramatic changes. With Invisalign, we're incrementally moving teeth by a series of aligners that you change out every two weeks. So movement is often much slower, and it's not really until probably the middle toward the end of the case that you really notice substantial changes. As far as movement of teeth, some things we can do a lot more quickly and efficiently with conventional braces than we can with Invisalign. Like I said, the challenge with Invisalign is just the series of aligners. And if we come into a problem with fixed braces, we can often move brackets, change wires, and shift gears midway through the treatment. With Invisalign, you can't really do that. Sometimes you can do what's called a mid-course correction, where you're taking new impressions and kind of starting all over again. But really, you want to try to avoid that just to stay on track. The biggest thing that I tell my Invisalign patients is that Invisalign is only as successful as patients allow it to be. And that means you have to be dedicated to wear the aligners 24-7 exactly the way we ask you to, because if not, teeth will not track properly, they will not move properly, and then we're not making forward progress. Most of the time it's not as painful as traditional braces, just depending on the severity of the case. It is a costly system. Regardless of the fees, we do at Silver Smiles try to make it affordable for you to seek care, whether it's with conventional braces or Invisalign. I often get the question, can you just treat one arch? And unfortunately with Invisalign, you cannot just treat one arch. You have to have models made of the top and bottom because it's important that the teeth fit together properly in the final result. But truly, in order to determine whether you're a candidate or not, we, we have to uh, do a proper evaluation and look. For patients, I can tell you they are so excited and enthusiastic that they chose Invisalign. And the thing that they love the most is people cannot see them and their teeth are constantly moving. Not only can they not see them, but they can't hear any difference in their speech and I have never had an unhappy Invisalign patient. 